Salute there, YouTube. And what's poppin', people? BBD has got a fresh new topic for you today. Something I've thought of often and it's never been spoken about on here is masculine frame. Alpha male RP masculinity type content or MGTOW for that matter. Is it demonic or satanic? BBD's gonna chop up this topic with a big old bam. Bam. Bad boy D. Masculinity. TV. And almighty father in heaven, please provide me with the right words. Please provide me with the discernment to say what I require saying. Because Yahweh rules. Yahweh rules. When it comes to some of like the self-improvement and the alpha male masculine frame, yada 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 fill in the blanks content, I often think of I suppose I didn't look at the teachings, but I heard of them of Alistair Crowley, who was like, not to give him too much credit, but to describe him, he was like the Alpha Don Dada of satanic stuff. So not a good Alpha Don Dada to be. If you're gonna be an Alpha Don Dada, you wanna be an Alpha Don Dada some positive good stuff obviously however his teaching was do what thou wilt and you know what that seems to be and I've been guilty of it too and you have to put that in perspective when you're doing like the self-improvement masculinity detaching from the blue pill society because man, when you put your alphaness into high gear and you do what thou wilt, I'm telling you, man, it's pretty fun. It's, it's unfortunately a stage I think I think most of y'all have gone through, and I obviously went through, and it's um. It is awful fun doing what thou wilt. You're basically, <laughs> you're basically at a high level social, so, so, social skill or standing or things of that nature. And you're, you're just going about the world. It's like you got a cheat code for the world and you're just, you're using the cheat codes. It's, it's fun. I'm not gonna lie. But the greatest cheat code of all is being down with the almighty God because <laughs> you don't. Afterlife wise, well, you can fill in the blank on that too. Because it's sure, it sure is easy to get an ego too when you're down with this type. When you know what you know, it is sure easy to get a, an ego. And I, I really encourage because I see it so much. That's why. Don't think BBD's insulting your intelligence when he says this, but there's a lot of people, and this, this falls into all aspects of knowledge. Shout out to Max Egan, because he said, <laughs> the, only, the only real truth is nobody knows the truth. I pray for that man, because he... He is super wise, but he doesn't, he, he 
he's he's more into the new age, and he's not down with the Almighty Father in heaven. So I, I pray I pray for his protection. I pray for that. He also has a top notch saying: "It's stare at infl- infinity without flinching." People develop too much of an ego. Some people read one book and think they're an expert. Some people, and you don't ever. The, the smartest, the smartest people, the people with the n- most knowledge, always know that they can learn more. I got in a in a thing, and I I, I don't I very rarely and well I didn't get in. It was almost as if he was trying to get in a thing with me. But I I left I left a harmless comment about there there was a there was a man talking about, and and it was an outstanding video, it was about the different terms and terminologies and how, how God is pagan, but, and he argued me on that, that I said, the Almighty knows if your heart's in a good place, and he said that he despises it when he, no, he used a stronger word, he hates it when people say that, however, we got into thing because I like to call him Yahweh and some people like to call him Yahuwah. And I've got no problem. I like I like Yahweh. I think he, he knows if you're addressing him or another one. So he anticipated the Almighty knows everything and he knows everything from the beginning to the end of time and he anticipated languages and changes and what they would change. So anyhow. And he, he shot me a link for videos that were in favor of his point. And I shot him, a, I said, thank you, I'm going to watch him. And I did. And I shot him a link of a, a video that supports Yahweh. And he deleted my comment. <laughs> so, I don't know, man. To me, that's just more evidence that... The name is Yahweh, and he rules. <laughs> because that's the that's 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 the end game of alpha male and masculinity and self improvement. It's being down with the Almighty God. It's it's fun. I think we all require going through that stage. That stage where it's. You have to experience life for a little while with the cheat code. So it's extremely fun. Or if you are going to embark on that stage, do it with sinning as little as possible. We all sin, that's why we require salvation. And yes, you do want to be masculine. You do want to be strong. You do want to be centered and stoic. It feels natural, it feels good, because ultimately the Almighty designed us that way. However, try not to partake too much in the flesh. Try not to partake too much in this world. Because you're going to be in a world of hurt. And as I've said time and time again, it's time to detach from this world because this world is... It's coming to an end. Like you fill in the blanks and put your own spin on it, however, but regardless, it is in, in every aspect and point you could possibly think of, it, it, it's coming to an end. So you can detach and try to sur- survive as a true free man with your integrity and your soul intact or be assimilated into the technocratic new world biometric AI big brother surveilled it's it's Hell is the absolute worst place and nobody wants to go there and I wouldn't wish my worst enemy to go there. I don't want anybody to go there. 
but it's going to be going into this new world. If you want to go into that, there's nothing alpha about that. <laughs> you, you will not be allowed to be alpha. It's <laughs> it, it, if you want to live in the new worldly system that's coming, alpha will not be permitted. And you can say, oh, well, I'm going to be alpha and blah, blah, blah. They can go blah, blah, blah. Okay, but if you want to participate in the new system and you want to be alpha, you're not getting any currency. They're going to turn it off. It's a brave new world we're going into. Nobody knows what's going to happen. Just prepare yourself mentally and spiritually. That's all I'm saying. Because... In my opinion, the Almighty has to crush this world much sooner than later. If you think of all the abominations, all of it's it's bad, fellas. It's bad. Pardon the, the darkness right now. I hope you enjoyed this rant. I hope you got something out of it. Please feel free to add some uh, good stuff in the comments and whatnot. Much love to you fellas. The only reason I, I, I keep plugging away on these videos is I do I do want to help people and much love. I'm out of here. Peace.